he is really starting drama up here. Well, our daughter is sick. Like, he was, what did he say? Um, he came back asking for the papers, like her hospital papers. And I'm like, and I'm like, well, and then he was like, this lady need them. I was like, why did the lady need them? So she can come get them. And then, so the lady came in and the nurse, she came in and um, asked for the paper. I was like, uh, is he asking for the papers? And she was like, yeah, he wants a copy of it. I was like, no. Mm -mm. Because why did he Why did he need them? It's just saying that she went to the emergency room. He doesn't need them. So she was like, do you not feel comfortable? I was like, no, because there's a lot going on right now. And then he was talking about going to the police. Because it's, it's his visit day, but still, she's sick. That's inconsiderate. Like, is that a word? I don't even know if that's the right word to use. <laughs> but, like... Who was trying to make this kid just go? And then it's like, I don't even know what to talk about. I'm just really upset. But the lady said that she's going to get a social worker to come up here, like a hospital social worker, to tell him, like, she don't need to go with you. Even though, because the, the nurse even under, understood, like, you, she does not need to go with you. But, um... Yeah, she been we've been up here all day. It's like probably eight something, probably nine something. We've been up here since five o'clock in the morning. We've been up since two o'clock in the morning. She barely even been asleep. She's knocked out. When the lady took her IV out, she didn't even wake up. Like the fuck is this damn problem? I'm like really getting upset right now. But I ain't even saying that to him. I I mean I, I said what I had to say to him. He said he he was gonna go to the sheriff's he was gonna go to the sheriff's station and snitch or whatever, or something, whatever. I was like, go ahead. I mean I'm not I was like, that's fine. I'm like, I'm, I'm like, I'm supposed to be scared. Do he not know that when it comes to my daughter, I don't fucking give a damn about what nobody say or nothing. I'm not scared of no police. I'm not scared of nobody. If I feel like I need to be there for my daughter and I feel like I got to protect my child, best believe I'm going to do that shit. Because I don't give a fuck. My daughter is staying with me. I'm making sure she's very taken care of, make sure she's okay and everything. So as far as what he's talking about, I don't give a fuck. The sheriff... Police come knocking at my motherfucking door. I ain't even go. I don't even care, you know. So I'm just really sick and tired. It's, you know, I that I told I told him that she was at the doctor's. He came up here. Now he's starting stuff up here. Like who fucking does this? Like this is at the time but we should be getting along. And I've been I tried to get along with him. I told him what's going on and all that stuff. That she doesn't need to go on a visit because she's not feeling good. She's sick. And now he's just starting shit. And I'm like whatever. I don't even care, like, whatever. And my mom is on her way right now to come get us, and the lady said for me to just stay in here if I um so I can be okay, so I'll be so I'll be so I'll be safe. You know, she said, and not too long ago she came in and told me that um so I'm probably pretty much the social worker probably not gonna come to the hospital social worker, and she said that he she looked in the, the waiting room and he wasn't in there, so maybe he left or he just stepped up out of there but she said for, for just to be okay just to be cautious or whatever i should stay in the room so um, i'm gonna start getting my stuff ready because we we're not like close to the hot we don't live close to the hospital but it doesn't take too long to get here um i don't know it's just like i mean i call our real social worker the one from dcfs I called her and left a message, but I, I forgot where I stopped off, stopped off at because I had the nurse that came in and I was talking to her. And um, so I need to call her again and make a different message, you know, so she can understand what's going on. So, yeah, uh, I'm just really just like so mad, so mad. And I called my grandma. My grandma was like, what? Cause she didn't know we was, in, we was at the emergency room. She was like, what happened? When I told her we was at the hot emergency room. And then so, um. Man, this shit is like fucking, ooh. I can this shit is like, from being fine, like, being happy that my baby is okay. He should be happy that his child is okay. Like, why would you start this shit? I don't even get it. Like, who does that? It's all for some money. It's all for his family. Why would you just... I don't know. I'm about to just cut this right now until next time. Like, I'm fucking just like, oh. Like, this is just like, I don't even understand what's going on. I don't, I don't know. But I'm about to start getting my baby ready. Like, she's so tired. Look at her. Like, what the hell? Why would you? 
Look how tired she is. Like, man, what the fuck kind of problem? Oh, I swear, I'm just like, man. I'm really just like fed up with this shit. Really am. And I don't know. I really don't know. All right. So right now I'm in my mom's car. I talked to the hospital social worker. She understood what was, she understood me. She said that yeah, I was um if that's how I felt, yeah, I shouldn't send my daughter out with him. And um like she's so tired, my daughter. She just is just like so I don't know, tired. Um we're at the gas station right now. Uh I forgot what she's about to wake up. You happy, mommy? She didn't even see her dad. He was she was asleep the whole time, and he coming up there with drama. Like that's fucking that's crazy. I've been up there all that time, been up all day, all I mean all morning for hours, and he just come up there starting shit. Like that's fucking crazy. To me, the social worker, because I left her message, she should see, like, okay, look at that. He started a mess at the hospital. Who does that? You want Baba? Here. You want Baba? Okay. You don't want it? Okay, 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 okay. I'm sorry. What's the matter? We almost, we about to go home too, mommy. Okay? Then you can lay down, play with your toys or whatever you want to do, okay? Oh, poor baby. It's all right. You want to get out, but you can't. We, we about to go drive. We about to leave right now. I think she woke. I think the the car movement made her feel better. Cause as soon as we start, she woke up. You want it now? You got your lips ready? No. Oh, poor baby, mommy. I don't like seeing my baby sick. I really don't. I feel helpless. I feel like I can't even make her feel better. You okay? Go night night. You still look sleepy. Are you hot? Zip this one. Zip it for you, mommy. My poor little baby. She didn't even cry with the IV or nothing. The doctor said she was going to have diarrhea, and she, lo and behold, she sure did. Woo, that was a stinking stink, stink. I have to take that off because she got boo boo on it. What? Uh, she seemed a lot better. She's drinking some water. Um, I need to get her some pedia care, pedia light, something like that. Yeah, so we're in here cleaning up this room. Then we're gonna clean up around the house too. But yeah, she's playing. You feel better? When we first got here, she was laying around, but yeah, she's playing now. Gonna fast store run. Getting some diapers for Jasmine because she's been boo booing a lot. I don't know what that Xbox thing is, but getting her some jello and some pedia light and these little burrito things that uh, my mom wants. So, yeah, my superior. Getting some stuff and I'm heading back home. Cause yeah, she's been boo booing a lot. So, I need to get some diapers. Dash. It's crowded on here. This little girl right there, she's so cute. She hit the lady next to her holding the basket, the bags, and they don't know. She she don't know her. And that remind me of Jasmine, cause Jasmine be doing that. On my way home to my baby. She's still sick. She um. She was doing fine, and then not so long ago she threw up. And she boo boo. I had her naked in the hallway because I was gonna put her in the tub and get all the throw up off of her. And um, while she was naked, she boo booed on the ground her diarrhea. So I went and wiped out, got it all off of her. And I'm trying to make sure she get a lot of fluids in because she threw it all up and she boo booed it all out. So um, I got that chair on Black Friday from Walmart. She wasn't supposed to use it. She wasn't supposed to get it until Christmas, but I let her sit in it. Because she's looking at TV. She's looking at cartoons. 
And she got her cut. And I try not to have too much of hot clothes on her because she was hot a little bit after not too long ago. You okay, baby? <laughs> Cutie. You cute out. <laughs> And he all talking about taking her. Like, what the fuck? Like, what time is it? Like, He would still be having her. Oh, well, I would give her a have her by now. And she would have been shitting and pissing. I mean, shitting and throwing up while we walking home. Yeah, mommy. She been booing all day since we got home. And she had threw up just fine. That's what the long ago threw up. And it was a lot. And I believe that she threw up everything that was probably in her stomach. So I'm trying to make sure she get a lot of fluids so she won't get dehydrated again. And we end up being at the hospital at night. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe she got a stomach virus, my mom said. So hopefully this goes away because I don't like my baby being sick. But good thing she looking, she looking at Spongebob. You all right, baby? Drink some water. <laughs> Drink some water. Drink some water so you won't get sick. Mm -hmm. I got her Pedialyte, but I'm going to go get it. I don't know if I should put it in make it cold. Yeah, drink some, mommy. She'll drink it, I guess, when she feel like it. <laughs> All right. 10.37 p.m. in Jarlene. She's just chilling around, drinking water. I haven't gave her no milk since. Well, I don't know. She had milk like a little while ago. But I'm going to try not to give it to her. Um, she threw up not too long ago. And I'm trying to make sure she keep drinking water and stuff like that. I haven't gave her the Pedialyte. I just put it in the freezer. And um, I'm going to give her some of that later. later. This is like horrible. Diarrhea and throw up. Mm. My poor baby. Um, so, yeah. Haven't really done nothing since we've been back. Just been cleaning up and cleaning up boo-boo and throw up. <laughs> it just sounds so gross. But that's what's been going on since we got home from the hospital. Oh, and yeah. And when I went to the store to get her some diapers and stuff. Um, like I'll give her like a little bit of food. I'm gonna give her some baby food right in a minute because that's like easier to go down. It's you know, oh, I'm kind of tired. And then I go to court tomorrow for child support court. When is all this stuff gonna end? When I'm really tired of shit. I'm sorry, I be cussing quite a bit lately, but it's just like, man, there's just too much going on in my life. I want to wrap, I'd rather, because she doesn't have a visit tomorrow. Tomorrow's a Tuesday. I'd rather stay home, take care of my daughter, you know, but I got to go to court. And this is just like too much, really, too much. But, all right. Mike, I think this might be the end of this video. Unless something happens to Jasmine and, you know. Lay down, Mommy. You want to lay down? Mm. Oh, you want to go sit in your chair? You want to go sit in your chair? Hmm? At least she doesn't act like how she was at first when we were at the hospital. She's still acting like herself a little bit. Not too long ago, she threw her cup at me. <laughs> Cause she was mad. What did she want? Uh, oh, she wanted my water, and I'm not gonna let her drink out of my water, you know. And so she got mad at her cup at me. My eye, something in my eye. But oh, oh. she needs to be going to sleep soon. She be taking. She been taking a lot of naps since we've been home. She looks sleepy right now. I'm about to get her ready to go to sleep. Lay her down so she can go to sleep. 
Hopefully she does. She doesn't wake up throwing up. Mm. And while she's asleep, I'm gonna get her. Um, Cause she's almost done with this water right here. She only has a little bit left in it. She's at least she's drinking her water. She is drinking water because she had a lot of water. This was full, uh, filled up like a couple of, not like a couple of minutes ago. Probably like I want to say 15 minutes ago. Probably something like that. But it wasn't long ago. And she's drinking it up. <clears throat> um. Yeah, so I'm gonna put some more ice water in here. And then I'm gonna get another separate cup and I'm gonna put a little bit of Pedialyte inside of it. Um, and see if she'll drink it. Hopefully she'll drink it. She's falling asleep right now. She's getting sleepy. You sleepy, mommy? I don't like seeing my baby sick. I swear, it's just like the horrible feeling. Hopefully she'd be better about time tomorrow morning. Mm -mm -mm. I'm, take, I'm taking her temperature every now and then to make sure she, you know, to see if she have a fever. And then whenever, if she did, she had like a little fever, not like a, probably like an hour ago, a little bit over an hour ago. And I gave her some Pedialyte, some infant Pedialyte, and she threw it up. Um, I guess, like, the taste made her throw up. So, she didn't really get the medicine, but you never know how much she had got. So, I didn't give her no more. Um, and that's, no, probably not even over an hour. It's been, like, a while now. Um, I'll probably check her temperature. I, mean, I will check her temperature soon. Like, I checked it not too long ago. and Because she feels hot every now and then. But right now she doesn't okay. feel hot. Right now she doesn't feel hot. So. Yeah. My poor baby. I don't see how she got sick. Just like out of nowhere. It's weird. She haven't ate nothing new. Um, so, hopefully this is just like a 24-hour thing and she'll be just fine tomorrow. Messing with stuff. Being a little baddie bear like she used to. Even though she's still been messing her. She's been running around still, but just not as much like she usually do. This is not her just laying around. So, yeah, she really is tired right now. And then her eyes look sunken in. Like a little bit. She's falling asleep. But, um, I'm gonna get her ready. Lay her down. So she go night-night. And only got like this on her. So she'll stay cool. But she won't get hot. Alright. Well... Thank you guys for watching. Um, most of these videos will get up probably. Um, most of these videos you guys see has been they've been posted late because I have to edit them because I'll be f they're like they're filmed. Oh, I'm sorry, baby. I gotta add them all together, like the clips, and then some parts I have to edit out because sometimes like people interrupt me while I'm talking to the camera because they don't know I'm videotaping and, and just stuff like that so yeah she's been going through a lot of diapers a lot from boo boy and I don't know sleepy she's I feel a little bit hot right now but all right. Oh, I need to call it tonight. Feeling in my eyes. But um, yeah. Hopefully things go all right tomorrow. Cause I don't even understand why we're going back to court. 
but what if? I don't know. I don't get why we're going back to court, but I think it's because he had given us a paper for us both to look for a job. He wanted Jeffrey's dad to look for a full-time job and me a, a, a part-time job or whatever kind of job. And, um, because, like, how can I get a job? I'm going to school. I'm doing counseling classes. Every day, I'm pretty much doing something except for, um, Thursday. Mondays and Wednesdays, I'm at school. Tuesdays and Fridays, I'm at my individual counseling class. So, it's like, and then there's people like her, 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 the guy that comes to our house for her, and I'm always going to court, and it's like, how can I have a job? And then I have a daughter, she, when she gets sick, I'm, I'm, I'm staying by my daughter, you know, I'm staying by her, even though there's people, Angel's trying to get in the room, there's people that have um, kids, and they get sick, and they go to work, but it's like, I'm not used to that. I mean, I'm not working. Um, if I was working and my daughter, like today, I was supposed to go to school. I didn't go to school because my daughter is sick. So it's like I don't have a set schedule to be able to even get a job. And then jobs want you to have an open schedule. And even if I was to find a job, it, I feel like it has to be somewhere not far because I'm on the bus and I have to have my daughter in school at the sheriff's station at a certain time and then I have to be there at a certain time to get her. You know what I mean? So um I don't I don't understand how people expect me to just have a life and I'm pretty much always doing something. But yeah. Like I was at the TDA meetings, I had to take her to the hub. Just all kinds of stuff. Mmm. This is good. Um. I'm tired. I pretty much been up all day. Since 2 this morning. I've been woke since 2 this morning. On and off, I would take like little cat naps, but it ain't, I had like a full sleep, you know. So, um, I don't even know if, I'm, if I need to bring anything to court. Like, what what do I bring? Um, but that judge needs to know that he took me back to court for more visitation just to bring the child support lower and stuff. Because, um,. I don't even know if that guy would remember us. You know how judges and you know, all type of people, they see a lot of people throughout the days. And they just, it's just too much. A lot of mess is going on. I need a lawyer. I really do. I need to get a lawyer to represent me. Because me trying to fight this myself, it's not working. Um, and I don't know how, even if I was to say the things that I gotta say, it's like I gotta say it in a um, professional way or a lawyer type way or whatever I don't really know but um I need to get a lawyer I don't know how I'm, I mean how I'm afford one but I need to get a lawyer to see if I can get some shit fixed because there's no way that I should have to send my daughter to her dad while she's sick there's no way even when she had a fever that time and I had sent her over there and I didn't like it, but she had a visit that day. Because the day before, uh, she had a, the night before, she had a fever. And I told him about it. I gave her, told him information and all that stuff. But yeah, I'm tired. I don't know why I'm talking so much. But all right. That's the end of this video. Until next time. Um, see you guys later. All right. Say bye. Do you have the energy to say bye? Are you going to say bye for me, mommy? No? Alright. Get you ready for bed. 
I'm gonna give you a little bit of baby food though first. Oh, you want some Jello? I'll give her some Jello. I might bring both up here. See which one she wants. All right. Bye. Say, are you saying bye? Say bye. You was doing it. My leg was in the way. Say bye. Say bye, mommy. Look at this fat belly. Is it empty because you keep throwing up? <laughs> but Oh, and then her butt is turning red. Like, I don't know if it's a rash or what, but her, like, by her cootie cock, it's red. Uh, I think it's from her not uh, booing so much. But um, I use desitin on her. I just put it right And she doesn't really like me wiping it, but I have to wipe it. I try not to wipe it hard. Because um, it seems like when I touch it, she cries. So my poor baby, she's just so miserable. So miserable. And I'm like, man. But, um, yeah. All right, bye. <laughs> bye. I'm on my way to court. This time, it's child support court. I'm running a lot behind. Hopefully they'll still see me and uh, we didn't get called yet because I know it'll be a lot of people at child support court So I'm praying to God That um, it's not too late because it was hard getting ready So I'm so tired because Jasmine she was waking up and off on and off waking up and um I had to make sure I left everything my mom need for her if she, Just in case she throw up or get sick again You know But I'm like That's the building right there I'm fucking <laughs> Okay, I'm walking. <laughs> Man, this is like, whew. and it's early. It's like eight something. I'm trying to hurry up. Man, then I gotta go to metal detectors. I don't even know what for where I'm supposed to go, so I gotta ask somebody where I gotta go. I don't even know why we're coming back. I don't understand. But, yeah. I think I'm right, almost there. I'm walking. I hope I just don't slip and fall. Okay, I'm here. Let me catch this leg. Oh, this is the same court. Ooh. This is the same court building. His girlfriend threatened me. He had all his family members and stuff. I gotta hurry. Fuck. Shit. All right. Fingers crossed. Four. I'm waiting and they said just take a seat and someone be with you so a lot of people here so far I didn't see her dad because I, I don't want to look just like looking like I'm looking around for him so I don't know if he's behind me or if he went upstairs already I don't really know so um, yeah this is craziness but all right <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I'm leaving the court building. Um, all he had there, I only seen his mom and his sister there. Uh, he could have had them remember somewhere else, but you know, I'm not worried about it. I'm just about to go home to my baby. Um, nothing happened. Everything's gonna stay the same. Money wise, it's just gonna be 244 the same. Um, we both are supposed to continue to look for jobs. Um, so yeah. Um, I see them coming out the door right now. His mom and his sister. But, uh, okay.
so um yeah um, i don't know if you guys can hear me but let's see so his excuse for not he didn't even do job searches his excuse was that his job was um, offering full time and he said that he applied for it and he won't find out until two to three weeks it doesn't take that long to find out if you're gonna get hired full-time at the job that you're already at so i think he lied but i'm like whatever uh um so i'm supposed to continue to do job searches he's supposed to still do it even though he applied for full-time <coughs> so i gotta go somewhere tomorrow for Looking around, making sure they don't drive up on me or something, you know. Cool. Yeah. What is this? Uh, Walgreens. Wait, is this Walgreens I'm at? Oh yeah, Walgreens. I don't even know where I'm at. But I'm looking at some of their stuff. Look at these toys. They're three for $13.98. It seems like a good deal. And look at these baskets. They're cool. I don't know. Because I don't want to have to carry around all no, no stuff with me. I like to look at the baby stuff. See what I find. I want a baby out. Mm. Oh, that's what I can look for. They don't even have it. I was gonna look for the Pedialyte ice popsicles, but they don't have it. They just have the drink. Damn. Today went okay. I thought it would have been like stressful and stuff, but it didn't. Dang, why they don't have them? People must be buying those all the time. Pedialyte, the ice popsicle things. I sure don't see it. Dang. They sure don't got them. Because it would have been right there. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, there they go. Oh, but this is the Walmart Greens brand. Should I get these? For children one year in age. Ariel. Electrolyte solution. I'll just get the store brand. It's heavy. Cause I guess the real ones they were no wait they were six forty nine and there's none left. That lady on in my way. Friend, it's a big bear. It's big. It's gonna be bigger than Jasmine. And um, the reason why I got this is because it's so cute. And then um. Because when we were at that place where she had to go get the little scan thing at the hub, she liked it, those big giant ones. So I was like, I'm getting this for my baby because she been sick. She deserves something nice. Whew. I gotta touch the street. She deserves something nice and hopefully she likes it. So, yeah, my poor baby. She deserves a bear, a big giant bear. She likes little bears anyways. She loves teddy bears. She had this little one. Uh, like Her first one was like this Christmas one, but it was like a bunny or dog or something like that. And she used to love that one. And she liked it, the one that um, the lady had gave her at the place when she seen the giant one. So this is close to her giant one. <laughs> the me to that giant one. So. so yeah, I'm about to go to the court building and get the paper. I mean, see if I have to copy something out of my court case. And uh, the reason why I don't have the camera on me all the time is because people be looking. I'm not used to having the camera on me, and people be looking like, "What the heck is that girl doing?" So, um, 
Yeah. Even this lady looking at me just now, and I don't even have it like facing me. She just looked at me like, what the hell? Cause I guess like how I'm holding it, it looks like I'm filming. So, um. Oh, my bus is coming. Let me hurry up. Crowded. I've been on crowded than this, but I'm gonna put this papers in this bag with this bear because I don't want them falling. Okay. <laughs> I gotta wash those eyes though. They can come off probably. I mean, you know, you gotta wash eyes like this. I'm at home right now. Um, I've been home for like a while now. Um, when I first got here, Jasmine, she was laying on my mom. We were downstairs. And I showed her bear and she liked it. Um, she drinking her bottle. She getting sleepy. I just changed her twice since I got here. She poopled. She just poopled through her clothes. And she was just pinching on her bear like, while she's drinking her bottle. But, um... She was looking at cartoons. You sleepy, mommy? And I gave her some medicine. Let me see. Make sure nothing was on your back. Um, I'm about to lay her down because she's getting sleepy. She ate some noodles. Uh, she, my mom was like, she didn't want to drink no water. She wouldn't drink anything. So, thankfully, she's starting to drink something and she's eating something. Um... Yeah, I'm about to put her something else on, and I just probably might put a, just a t-shirt on her onesie, so she won't get too hot. Try to keep her temperature down. Um, yeah, I'm gonna give her, put her t-shirt on, and I'm gonna lay her down, see if she'll go to sleep. Cause she, my mom said she was sleeping a lot since I've been gone. When I got here, she was woke, so. Uh, hopefully she, she's alright. She's just sleepy. She's been sleeping a lot. You're such a cutie.